it's it's another day of just recording this when I have like well like I had I had gym I see a personal trainer they have like three stages to their program I've started the strength phase which is like the most brutal stage where you increase the weights like by a lot and you mainly just like you go for five to eight reps instead of like 10 to 12 ish reps. But then there's some exercise where you do drop sets and you actually go for like 30 reps. So, like, stuff that just absolutely kills me on the inside, like um, 20 reps on, reps on leg extensions, which are these ones. Um, then um, there was also. 30 reps on calf extent uh, on the calf raises machine sorry um which is the drop set thing and then to top it all off i did 215 no two i normally do 213 kilos on leg press but today because i was doing five to eight it was because i was doing eight reps instead of 12 reps i did 253 kilos and then to top that all off i had an eight hour shift after that like, I finished my gym at 10.45, I came home quickly, had a protein shake, and then headed straight to work, which started at 11. So I was, like, slightly late, but... Oh my god. I don't have work tomorrow. I have fucking nothing other than gym tomorrow, so I'm so relieved, and that'll probably be the day I expect to actually make progress. But for now, I'm, it's just another day where I'm just absolutely smashed, absolutely tired. Probably only going to spend maybe an hour on it today. I don't even really have any practice time goals, to be honest. I'm just fucking doing a run through while I talk about this shit. Oh my god. Not to mention the past two days, I've pretty much worked eight hours as well, so. Which, like, I know there's plenty of people out there who work eight hours a day. Like, 40 hour work weeks, or some people do even more. But yeah, I'm still sort of adjusting into it. Yes, I am a whiny little baby, I'm sorry. I think I'm just gonna set the goals to make it to floor three once today. And I'll drag that floor five goal back. This jump, I don't know. I think I'm just gonna try and make sure I'm not I'm not on a super intense angle. Like, I don't wanna be doing that. I think I've just gotta make sure. Wait. <gasps> How? Oh, I don't know what. Mm. I don't know how I didn't realize that this was possible sooner. But I don't think I'm ever. I just don't. Nah, it's not worth it. I'm not gonna make it this far, but it's worth practicing. You know, I was so bored at work when it's not busy today that I just pretended I had my keyboard in front of me on the dress bench. You know, where you dress stuff. Where you, you know, like you. Where you make the food, like the bench, where you make the food. I was just pretending I was on my keyboard and mouse and trying to remember how I'm supposed to do this. Because I think it's literally just like, literally just like angle my, like it's like I've got to like, I don't know, I've just got to not think about it to be honest. It's time for, to externalize my anxiety. That's not the name of the tower. Yeah, my middle finger is still swollen as hell, so I still can't flip anyone off. I mean, press the W key. Oh, ho, ho, I like it. What was that lag? Are you serious? That was the most dog thing that's ever happened to me in history. It was like, oh, I'm so excited to be on foot. No, please don't. Thank you. That's what should have happened. For some reason, I just don't feel very confident. It's like my mouse grip feels wrong. The way my arms are angled against the desk feels wrong. It just does not feel right or comfortable for some reason. Okay, task manager. Let's have a look-see. Oh, anti-malware service executable, of course, just has to run the Microsoft Defender antivirus just has to run a background scan right now while I'm playing this game. No wonder why my computer's so laggy, bro. Oh, he, he's booted up a game. You know what? Let's do a scan. Let's fucking do it. Send it. There was a guy that um, came into work today. Like, like a customer. And like, 
you've got like your v-neck sort of shirts this dude had like a like you know that image of like gravity space and time being manipulated by a super heavy object pulling it down that guy had one of those neck shirts like we could there's like almost like a mankini <laughs> for a shirt like his whole chest was this like exposed like but like the nipples weren't but like they were pretty close to being exposed and it just went down to like right above his belly button i'm like this man woke up today and chose to wear this i have heard about fps unlockers and i'm genuinely wondering if it's worth getting one or like what the stance on that is in general in terms of roblox rules and policies and jatoa like if i get an fps unlocker and go set it to 240 fps which is like the refresh rate on my screen am i going to get sent to the shadow realm i just feel like it would help me a lot more be a lot more accurate with jumps there's probably someone out there that's beaten tower of inception by on a laptop with like 20 fps and i'm just here whining i need to like do a deep dive analysis into what like into like my desk and like the things it's sitting on if there's something under it that's making it unstable because every fucking tap on my keyboard is making it wobble like how how are you wobbling so much bro you know maybe i'm actually only using like 20 percent of my power and once i fix all my desk and mouse issues i'll be just like oh what tower of grand final whatever it's called generation failure easy oh my I'm having a hot streak with that jump, my god. I hope to be this consistent every day now. I'm actually about to go feral this right with all these like basic R floor on fails. But Okay, make it. Okay, one, two. Wow. We're not even gonna make it to jump three now. Okay, oh my god, you've made it, GG. Oh, oh, new PV, new PV. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god, I've never been this far before. Dude, I don't know what the hell has happened, but I've transferred my practice time consistently to that jump. Clearly, they nerfed this jump yesterday, surely. They must have nerfed it. They found out about my secret playthrough of this. It's not very secret. I've got a roadmap for it and everything. Oh. Yes, my hot streak with that run. What? Okay, this is my PB for today. Thank you for actually making it. Was my goal to make it to floor three today? Because I have aced that goal. Yo! Nice. Oh, bro. Why is he visible? I actually specifically have it so he's not visible. That's one of the settings I put in this game. Did you know that? That I told you not to make him fuck. It's probably because I spectated him. I'm never spectating anyone ever again. I'm just gonna mine my own freaking. I wanna go back to chapter one of Fortnite, season five to seven, the goaded era, when I sucked at the game. All my friends knew I sucked. And they just never, they, they, they still played with me, but they knew I fucking sucked. And then I had that one clutch moment, and that was like the peak of my life. And then, it's all been downhill. I like peaked in high school, no bro, I peaked in Fortnite. <laughs> bro, I'm just like, I'm actually genuinely tempted to go back to Fortnite. Like, Fortnite is up there with the nostalgia factor, like with games like this as well. Like, I used to play Fortnite a lot. Like, I played this a lot, played this a lot. Like, this is the same sort of, like, me playing Jatoa, same sort of era as me playing Thanos. <laughs> me playing Thanos Tower three years ago, it's the same sort of era I did Fortnite and stuff. I was starting to hop off Fortnite a bit, though, in 2020, so I don't know. Okay, I actually feel really confident about Floor 2 now. I mean, there's just, like, there's just a few, like, sussy, bossy jumps, and then everything else is fine. <gasps> I might take it that back that everything else is fine. That's classic me um, underestimating everything. Nice. Holy fuck you. Okay, I need to get a bit closer. Yeah. 
Nice. Oh! <gasps> fuck you! Fuck you! Oh! Oh my god. Why does this floor have to be the sketchiest fucking thing on the planet? What the fuck? Okay, this is better than yesterday, right? I think yesterday I didn't even make it to floor four. I mean, I could still fail this. I would actually... Please? Okay, this jump is stinky. Oh, I'm stinky. Oh, <laughs> that's the... <laughs> this is the worst one-liner I think I've ever used in my whole life. Okay. Fucking kill me. Here we go. I'm at my fucking PB, bro. Why did I do the trust flick again? Am I fucking stupid? I literally said last time, don't fucking do it. Like, it's not like, it's not like trust flicking is my default go-to, like, to play this game, right? Like, you've seen how I do trust jumps throughout this series. Like, why did, why is that what I default to there? All it takes is one big fail like that, and my brain just shuts off. Something I'm noticing is the whole passing of time. Like, I just realized that this is four days I've done this. However, like, Tower of Extreme Hell took me five days to beat. And it just felt so much longer than five days. Like, meanwhile, this has barely even felt like the fourth day. And tomorrow being the fifth day is kind of crazy to me. Like, I don't know. It just doesn't... Like, Tower of Extreme Hell felt like such a long, like... Such a long journey but this feels like and it's obviously going to be a long journey but so far it's felt so much shorter i've definitely spent a lot less time recording but i don't know like the average recording for this is like probably like an hour and 20 minutes whilst tower of extreme hell's average recording is like two and a half hours what how did I even jump off that block? It's like I didn't even land on it. Yeah, now nah, the sleep wave's hitting really hard. I'm way too tired to be able to concentrate. Right, I think this is my last floor two run. I think once I fall or make it to floor three, that's it for me. I need to like actually do this one because like, I feel like my alignment is so off. World's most tired gamer on 4-3? What the hell, how? No, I actually feel like I could fall asleep and it's like the worst time. Is that a spider running along my desk? Wow. Floor 4. Almost. Oh, shit. I mean, I think I have to do this jump. Yeah. Alright, easy. Oh. Fark, this could be really bad. Can I do one of these? No. Okay, first off, let's not die to health. So this is a really bad spot to have landed. Okay, I think my best chance is to just hop down to this platform, which fucking sucks. Oh my god, please do not shift up like that. Nice. Oh, oh man. That's annoying. So close yet so far. I don't know. We'll get there eventually, but today is not it. I'm excited to actually try this tomorrow when I have some energy. Watch me like make it to floor two tomorrow as my PB and that's it. <laughs> oh jeez. Anyway, yeah. It's fine. We're fine, I think. I still have, well, it's Wednesday. I still have, like, a solid, like, week and a half to beat this. So, it's fine. But, yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoyed still. Um, I'm going to go to sleep now. <laughs> Good night. Welcome to the end card. Um, that ending was very abrupt. Um, that scared the shit out of me while I was editing. <laughs> but, anyway, we now have one extra run on day four, um, 
that we did not make it to floor eight plus on. So we did actually make it to our PB again, but unfortunately, did we pass it? No, we we did we didn't we didn't pass it. Also, sorry for the amount of f bombs in this video. Like, holy 